it's Monday and I'm just on my way out to go pick up some packages. First of all, I have two in my P.O. box. Might be from some of you, but it might also be orders from my Depop that has been returned to me for some reason or another. So we're gonna go and um, see what that is. If it is packages for me or if it's just packages that are getting returned for some reason. I hope not. Let's cross our fingers. And then I also have another package somewhere else that I'm gonna pick up and maybe I'm gonna go buy the thrift shop nearby my P.O. box. So we're gonna go out and enjoy the frozen weather. It's so beautiful outside. It looks amazing. I love when it looks like this. It's just crispy and magical, I think. <laughs> so first of all, I just quickly, because I've had so many questions about it, I thought it would be way easier just to tell you guys in this vlog. I'm just gonna quickly tell you where this small pink pail overall kind of dress where that's from and where this sweater is from and also I have a pair of pants and a hat I'm just gonna go get it um, I show you these things I think in the previous vlog because I just received it all in the mail so I'm gonna leave links down below to these things like first of all this beautiful sweater with these um, I don't know things on it it's so cute and then this overall dress in pink pale this hat that I also tried on in the video with pearls on it. And last of all, I think what most of you have asked about are these plaid pants with these up here. It looks so cool and stylish. I just went out and took a few pictures yesterday wearing these and can just put in a picture. But I'm gonna leave links to all of these things down below and I'm sorry that I didn't do that in the last vlog. I didn't know it was gonna be such popular items. But I'm gonna leave links down below. This is so feminine and cute. I love this dress. Like, I'm so crazy about it. And also the sweater. It's just such a great match, I think. Um, so yeah, links are gonna be down below. But I think we should get, get out in the frozen weather and go pick up all of my packages. I think I've decided that I'm gonna grab my bag because I don't have much time. It's about a quarter to ten and in an hour's time I have to get ready. I have to also have to get something to eat. I haven't had anything yet because I'm gonna go to the second hand place that I got a job recently. I have two hours today of like um, just teaching me all of the stuff that I have to know um, because they they have to like teach me all of these things before they can give me some shifts where I'm alone without them, if that makes sense. I think it does. Also, look at that. I'm gonna leave a link down below. Stop or hug more phone cover. Um, I'm still trying to make this like a group thing with all of the people who have one. Um, yeah, I'm gonna leave a link down below to my web shop as usual. But we're gonna go, just look at this, how pretty it is. I'm just gonna show you again. It probably won't catch it on camera, but that tree is just like frozen and so beautiful. And the sky is crystal blue. We're gonna get out there. It's gonna be so cold but pretty. So I'm just waiting for the thrift shop to open in a couple of minutes. Yeah, that's my bike. It looks a little bit empty but I am gonna go in and just have a look. And uh, it's cold. <laughs> I've decided to go pick up my packages first because they are not opening even though it's 10 o'clock. There we go, I've picked them up. I couldn't just wait around. So now we're gonna go back and see if they are planning to open or not. <laughs> I think it's one of the coldest days it has been this year. It's like minus four degrees so cold so let's see if they hit open it it is quite empty today but I have found a few things so I'm gonna show them to you when I get back home coats hmm It's always a super quiet in there. It wouldn't be a bad thing if they got some music. But I have all of my clothes here. And now we're gonna go pick up the last parcel and then go home and eat. I guess this is not my lucky day. The gear on my bike just broke. What's going on? But now we're gonna pick up 
the last package and uh, then I have to make a plan because what am I gonna do if I can't use my bike today? <sighs> so if any of you know anything about bikes, I only have one second and third gear and it won't go further than that. But it doesn't feel like third gear and they're all the same. Ah, uh, yeah. Good, so I'm back home and I just quickly wanted to show you the things that I went and picked up uh, from my PO box and also the few things that I just got from the thrift shop. So, I picked up a parcel and I found a few things from the thrift shop and this could be the thumbnail for the video. Smile. <laughs> so, the few things that I found in the thrift shop were just some, but like two of these are pretty basic, but it's because they have a rail with things that they have had in the shop for a long time and then they sell them for like, like three dollars per item. So I got this one, it's pretty basic, it's kind of a lace black blouse, but as you guys know I'm really into these overall dresses and I think this would be awesome to put like underneath, so the sleeves are like this and yeah, it's pretty basic. Nothing really like too interesting about it. And then I got this one that's super old school. I just love that it was kind of this cream colored blouse and then with blue and white flowers on it. It's like very, very old school, but I think it's super cool. So I got that one. It's a bit oversized. I don't really know how to style it yet, but I will see. And last of all, I got this white blouse that I'm also gonna wear under like overalls and stuff but look it got this like detailing but like each item was just so cheap that I thought we're just gonna have to see if it's something that I can use oh boo okay so I got a letter and a package and the letter is from I, I just can't read this I'm so sorry I can't read it I have no idea where this is from like it's from France, I can see that on the stamp, but that's like all I can see. Like this is my PO box address, but it's from France, that's all I can see on the back. I can't really read that. A cute small letter that are inside here. If my camera would focus on it, yeah, there we go. An angel, thank you. So, this was a late Christmas card from a girl in France. I just need a sister so that I can open this. I think, Loon, what are you doing? Okay, so we're gonna open up this cardboard box. So this one is from Elizabeth. Um, from it looks like it's from New New York City. Is that NC? At least it's from the US. I can see that. Oh, this is so cute on the inside. Just look at that. And it says for Elise, and then there is a letter. Oh, this feels like thick oh that's so cute here's a wish that's merry and bright that's the cart so as usual I'm gonna read this afterwards and also I always keep the carts I have this book with like memories from like social media and all of you guys where I put all of the carts and stuff inside so I will keep those in case you're wondering so what is in here like this is like Christmas I love this kind of stuff Okay, so in here we have a few things, and we have some things that are wrapped, so this is the first one that I'm going to open. It's like late Christmas presents. Okay, so what is this? Oh, it's for Loon! Oh, that's great. It's crispy Minnie's honey flavored treat sticks. Thank you! I think Luna is going to be so excited. She loves to chew these kind of things, so she's going to be so happy. And another small package with, oh, it's a pair of socks. Plants get me, those are so cute. <laughs> Just look at those. Not focus on my face, focus on the socks. Just look at those. Plants get me, and then there is like this thing watering a plant. Those are so cute. I love those. And then another wrapped one. Like, this is Christmas today. Wet and Wild. Oh, it's a red lipstick. Cherry Frost. Rich 
buildable color silk finish lipstick I can't wait to try that that's amazing I love like that sometimes I mention something in a video without like really thinking about it and some of you just remember that like one of you also sending me um, a package of lipsticks from the bomb which is my favorite brand and just the fact that you guys remember when I say those things it's just amazing like at some point I mentioned that I needed a new red lipstick and one of you has sent me that Elizabeth sent me that that's just you guys are crazy and then we have oh there's another one that's wrapped here I'm gonna open that as well oh it's another lipstick in another color so this is a darker red color and yeah, I just realized, I just noticed, they are cute, cruelty free, so that's good. Thank you so much, can't wait to try these out. Oh, did you hear that? Boo, you have to relax. And now, for one of these, there are like two of these that are packed like this. So we're gonna see like, what is this? Yeah. Whoa. This is perfect. This fits right into my living room. This is so beautiful. Look at this candle holder. Just focus on that, not my face. Just look how pretty this is. It fits perfect into my living room and there's like hearts all the way down here around the edges. That's so pretty. Thank you so much Elizabeth. That's amazing. I wonder if this is one that... Ooh, this is a mark. Oh, that's cute. It's a ceramic mug with a pineapple on it. But just the color of this is so beautiful. I love that it's like, it's kind of a pale yellow color. Cream yellow-ish. So cute. Thank you so, so much, Elizabeth. This was like so unexpected and just brilliant. Thank you so much. Um, I assume these were supposed to get here for Christmas time, but didn't. Um, so, like, thank you so much. Sometimes it's even better to be surprised when you are, like, least expecting it. Because I was not expecting to be sent presents today. I was actually thinking on my way up there, I was like, it's probably gonna be, like, packages that have been sent back for, like, one reason or another. But it was not. So I'm so thrilled. Thank you so much, girls. Thank you. So this is what I'm preparing for lunch. I'm gonna make myself some pasta. Then I have some red bell pepper, some garlic. I just bought this bread. That's a chili, chili pesto bread that I love so, so much. And then I have some different like spinach and some healthy stuff here. And I have some feta. So we're gonna, just gonna hurry and get this done. I'm gonna hurry out of the door now to go to the bus, uh, take the bus and then go to work so I'll be there like 15 minutes late but I'm gonna hurry now and go work for a couple of hours in the second hand shop so this is where I work and I'm just having a look around now this is so typical me that I'm like I'm not gonna buy anything today and now I am so I'm just having a look around and I'm probably gonna get a few things I also just found a bowl This is also pretty cute, all of the paintings are hanging out here. And yes, I did get myself a few things. I'm gonna show them to you when I get back home. But these are so pretty. My mom is gonna come by and pick me up because otherwise I had to take the bus because my bike is broken. So um, she'll be here soon to come and get me. Consider this bowl as an example. It's real pottery and then it has been hand painted in here. And I paid like one dollar for it. It's so, so cheap. It's from Portugal. So pretty. But you can see that it's dangerous that I keep spending money every time that I'm on work. Like, I've been working for two hours today and I've bought a few things. Like, I don't make money then. <laughs> so, yeah. But we're gonna go back home and get something to eat. Maybe do some shopping. I don't have a lot of food. Um, yeah. So I'm back home and just quickly wanted to show them to you a little bit better. So this is the Portuguese um, bowl. 
in pottery. And then I got this one that's in colored glass, so it's yellow. And yeah, it got a few legs. I don't really like legs on these, but it's just so beautiful. It looks like a flower inside it that I just thought, what the hell. And then I got this one that's just normal glass. And then with all of these details inside it. So I just think these three bowls are so beautiful that um, yeah, I got those three. And now I just have to wash them and then I can start using them. Good, so I've just grabbed myself a piece of bread and some Coca-Cola and now I'm just gonna sit down and edit some pictures I think and I think this fool down there, I think she would like to come out and run around so we're just ha gonna have um, some time together before I'm gonna get like, before I have to prepare myself for badminton training later today. So we're just gonna sit down and chill with Boo Boo. Boopy. Ooh, be careful, Boo. Don't get hurt, please. Please don't. Are you gonna run out to the kitchen? Yeah. Okay. You have lots of energy, Boo. Boo Boo? Oh, no, not so close. I can't film you. Look, Boo. We're gonna see. Okay, normally she will just wrap it and run away with it. There you go, Boo. You're not very afraid that I'm gonna steal it today? No. Oh, you just love those carrots. Yeah, you've become such a, like, real rabbit. When you were younger, you wouldn't eat carrots. But you don't remember that. No. <laughs> You're so cute. It's 20 minutes to 6 o'clock at night and I've just spent the afternoon on the sofa. I was editing some pictures, I was chilling with Luna and I was watching Friends. And um, now I'm actually just preparing myself to go to badminton. I haven't been out shopping any food or anything so I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow. But I'll be going to badminton and back again. Hopefully early to bed so that I can wake up early tomorrow. Um, so I actually think I'm gonna end this vlog here. So I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up if you did and um, subscribe if you aren't and I'm gonna see you guys soon. I don't know when. I think I'm gonna film a video like Wednesday and maybe have that up in the end of this week. So I am pretty busy at the moment because as you guys know I got the job in the second hand place that I showed you today. I got another job as a marketing assistant 15 hours a week. I have YouTube and Instagram and stuff that sometimes there are things that I'm gonna do but um, yeah there is hours put into that as well and then I have badminton and social events and like you know there's a lot of things to do so I'm trying my best to keep posting videos like regularly regularly but I am not going to be able to post like a video every day from Monday to Friday like I did before Christmas. It's simply not possible. I have too, too many things to do on my plate at the moment. So I'm going to try my best and try to have like at least two videos uploaded every week. So that is like my goal. Two videos a week minimum. So yeah. I'm going to head to badminton soon. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'm going to see you guys soon. Bye guys.